So today I decided that if I lose the game, I'm just going to let it go. I'm not going to stress about it. <laughs> I know that was bad. Anyways, it's me, Elsa. Florida Elsa. You know what's going on. It's a chest neck spooky special. I actually love the braid on this. The wig, but what's up with this Vegeta thing going on? Whatever. I'm going to play some chess. Y'all know the deal by now, I'm sure. I play chess. That's it, yeah. Sometimes I make jokes. Sometimes I just play chess. So I'm playing black with Elsa. What was my plan here? I don't know. I, I just started throwing stuff out, to be honest. <laughs> I think I can throw my knight there and check him with my bishop. Will it do anything? I don't know. Oh. Is it worth trading my bishop and my knight for his rook? Right here I'm attacking his bishop and his knight, if I can get his knight out of there, probably be pretty good for me. <laughs> I'm definitely, you know, approaching his space very aggressively. But, I did leave this pawn hanging just now. So, could not all be good. I was thinking about throwing my queen up here, but that kind of stops that idea. And it stops it pretty dramatically. <laughs> he could just take my knight with his queen. Wouldn't really be pretty. He's thinking of the same idea I was thinking about. <laughs> we have a... I mean, on this side, it's kind of symmetrical if I just castle. I wish I had something to do with this knight so I could continue with whatever I'm going to do over there. Yeah, I don't know if I have brain fog or just don't know how to play chess. <laughs> I think I'm actually going to throw my bishop here, possibly sacrificing it for his knight. Yeah, I'm going to do that. And if he takes with the knight, I take with the pawn, opens up my rook. That's how I'm thinking right now. Is it a good plan? I don't know. Yeah, I'm, I'm attacking this knight. Now this is open. <laughs> I 
Is it enough to win the game? I don't know. I actually didn't know I'm down on pieces, but I'm just hoping that my position can be enough to to win me the game. Still have a lot of time. And it, you know, like I said earlier, I just gotta let it go if, if it doesn't work out. <laughs> hmm. That that move sucks. But I think I could just put the queen there and it works. Oh, but now he can attack with the pawn or he can attack the pawn. Not ideal. Yeah, this is uh I don't know. It's kind of a hard position for me. A little more complicated than I'm used to. There's a lot of moving pieces. I think I can just move that here and it's not a problem. Not a hundred percent sure though. And uh I can also just take this piece as if he if he slips up and doesn't have some type of plan, I can just take that piece. I don't really think he can defend it. It's a weird position. I got a lot of threats over here. Um, I can check him with my knight. <laughs> hmm. Well, I can't just take that for free now. Thinking about rerouting there, but I don't know if I have a backup plan. That's what I'm going to do. could even maybe throw a pawn up there I mean obviously it would get rid of my defenses but let's not pretend I have much anyway on my on my king so if I throw the pawn up maybe here or here see maybe think about what that does force something. I'll force something. I'm attacking his queen. He has to respect it, at least in some way, shape, or form. I really don't want his rooks getting open there, but I just don't know if I can help it. attack his queen again I might be stretching there but can't go there can't go there I think I just won his queen and I don't think I have to trade down my queen can't go there he could go there I guess that'd be my biggest worry. <laughs> I 
I'll trade down because if he takes my queen, I take his bishop. I defend this pawn. It felt like I was winning material and I'm actually up a point now, so. That seems fine to me. He can't really do much of anything with this piece either. I'll threaten that piece. He'd have to move all the way back to one of these squares. And I think if I just take there, it works. I didn't plan for that, but I'll trade down a little bit. I'll even go all the way if he wants to. And then I'll just have a knight and an end game. That doesn't seem like the worst thing ever, you know? I have five minutes, he has three. As long as I don't make a big mistake, it's, it seems like I'm winning. But at the same time, I don't have much of a plan for how I'm going to have to defend all of his pawns with maybe just my knight and my king if he does take. Uh, if he doesn't take, not sure either. He can't move anywhere here. Oh, he can move there, but... <laughs> oh, I put way too many things on. I'll freeze that out, worry about this, get my king involved. Um, I just got a, a fork. Gonna start eating up pieces. If I just play defensively, it should be kind of fine. Need to think about maybe getting this piece out. Let me see. Not too far away. Three moves. <laughs> so I think I beat him now. His king is in his way of his path. I'm about to have a queen just lining him down. Okay, cool. Yeah, I, th I think I won that game, even if it was almost infinite time. It just seemed like, as long as I didn't like lose my queen or something, but let's say he keeps moving. I mean, I just, I beat him all the way. He has to move somewhere. I have a queen. Um, I also have a position to get another queen. So, so he moves there. I don't know. Just, I could check him there. Have to move back maybe. I don't know. I could almost sack this queen. Just pushing this pawn. Or if he, I could just throw away the queen pretty much. And... He takes, oh, yeah, oh no, he can't even do that. Yeah, anyways, <laughs> I'm not going to try to analyze all the ways I could have messed that up, but yeah, cool, Elsa won, yeah, that's cool, I'm excited, sorry I'm rambling, hope you enjoyed it.